Hi, I'm Mitchell Spearman. Here's my A to Z guide to improving your game. I'm going to be helping you with every part of your game, from B for a better ball position, to S to get rid of your slice, to P to holding more putts. Y is for yips. I've never had the yips, but I have seen them, and that's when a golfer stands over generally a short putt like this, and there's an involuntary movement that he doesn't want to have happen, and he yips it. There's a quick, sudden jerk. Obviously, over the last few years, we've seen the long putter, we've seen the attached putter to the side. That's all going to change when the rule changes. So will the yips come back? Well, if it does, and you find yourself struggling with this, you might want to take a leaf out of Jordan Spieth's book. What I like about the way he goes about hitting his short putts is he just looks at the hole. He takes everything normal, and before he starts his stroke, he just looks at the hole. And in doing that, it probably seems to take out some of that anxiety that you have over a short putt. Now, when I do it, I find it strange because I kind of don't know where my putter is and I like to look and know where it is. But I must say, if you find yourself struggling with the yips and getting that little involuntary twitch and you're not able to use the long putter or the attached putter to your left arm anymore, then maybe trying Jordan's look of just looking at the hole, look at the ball, look at the hole, and making a stroke is your way to cure the yips. Why for yips?